All right, welcome to Marvel Future Revolution. This new mobile game that's coming out soon uh, looks pretty promising. I've been watching some of the trailers that it has, um, even though some of these are from like a year ago and only a, I think like one of them's brand new. But anyways, so looking at this mobile game, this seems pretty jam packed with quite a lot of stuff. Not only uh, heroes, but villains and costumes and all sorts of stuff. It looks crazy, dude. So to start off, we have the villains, which they get their own neat little trailer, believe it or not. And you get to see Red Skull. You get to see Baron Mordo, Modok. Uh, I want to say Ultron was there. Uh, Green Goblin, Red Goblin, that weird, like demon version of a uh, green goblin funny uh and then there's even some more i want to say thanos and wilson fisk yellow jacket i want to say i remember seeing yellow jacket out there uh, there's quite a lot of these dudes out here and this is just the start which is pretty pretty good just to just have a start like this this is a pretty uh meaty meaty beginning uh, the characters that you get to start with, uh, I think it's like eight right now, but I think it's more. I want to say it's more than eight. Last time I checked, or last time that I heard, it was like eight. Uh, you had Miss Marvel, you had Captain America, Black Widow, Spider-Man, Iron Man, Storm, uh, Doctor Strange. Who else am I forgetting? Star-Lord was out there, yeah. Uh, but I want to say Thor, Vision... Uh, I think that's about it. Uh, the others that I, I'm not sure are confirmed, but I have been seen. Uh, but that's pretty cool. And they're all customizable, apparently, through the workings. <laughs> uh, the latest video that came out, or I think it was like maybe a live stream or something, at like games, Gamescon or something like that. I don't know. I didn't really look into it that much. I was just kind of watching somebody else. But um, there are so many costumes, dude. Someone said there's like three million costumes. I'm not sure if that's like paraphrasing or a joke, but <clears throat> the latest video that I saw f that uh, was around Iron Man had a lot of costumes, dude. It had the ultimate Iron Man, Superior Iron Man, the Mark I, um, and then it did show off some recolors of uh, the Superior Iron Man, I believe it was, like maybe four or five different recolors of the same costume, so I'm guessing that's where a lot of the big number, uh, where the big number came from, but uh, there was even, what do you call it, uh, oh god, what's it called, the... Uh, the Captain America, where it's where he's like a, a Hydra agent. There was even a uh, Iron Man costume of that, so that's in there. And I want to say that I saw a glimpse of the Endgame armor from in, uh, Marvel Studios Endgame, and maybe another one from a different movie. I couldn't see. I couldn't really tell. There was a couple others that blew past. It was kind of hard to see, but. There's a lot there. If you go to their, uh, was it Twitter, Marvel Future Revolutions, they even have some posts letting you know who the new villains coming into the game. Uh, and then they give you some, um, what do you call it? I guess lore or locations like, uh, uh, what was it? I want to say it was like Stark City was one of them. And then I want to say like New America was one of them where they give you like these little uh, uh, background information, I guess. So like uh, New America is like what would have happened if uh, the U.S. had lost World War II. And I'll have this picture up of it. It's like uh, a new, like I want to say maybe New York and it's just riddled with hydra stuff statues of red skull and hydra symbols everywhere oh god it's, it's crazy dude um but yeah the thing that i'm probably most excited about is the costumes they're having a lot of them dude i, I really enjoy customizing stuff there's even like a uh, hydra 
Doctor Strange. So I guess there's like a Hydra everyone, I guess. Star-Lord, Spider-Man, and stuff like that. But um, for a mobile game, this seems pretty packed, jam-packed with a lot of stuff. And I'm pretty excited for it. I can't wait to see all the different versions of like Spider-Man and uh, Iron Man, Captain America, maybe even Black Widow. Um, I'd love to see some other characters too, like Moon Knight, Punisher, uh, maybe Deadpool, Daredevil for sure. I'd love to see Daredevil. Um, but they did also say that the game was going to have like a PvP of some sorts. Uh, I don't think there was a video. There was a picture that's kind of got like, um, like a few heroes facing off against each other, which looks pretty cool. They're all pretty different looking. And, uh, yeah, dude, I'm just really excited for this game. I think it's going to be amazing. The open world aspect seems super cool. It almost reminds me of Marvel Heroes, which was a pretty sweet uh, PC and a console game. Uh, hopefully, this isn't just going to be a mobile game for, like, ever. And what a lot of people are hoping for is that it comes over to PC and console, which... I would also really enjoy, especially on the new systems. I think it'd look fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, that's pretty much it. That was all I had for the video. It was just a couple of clip -its, videos, pictures. Uh, tell me what you think down in the comments down below. Tell me who you're most excited for. Are you going to pick this up? I'm not sure if they're actually uh, asking money for this or if it's free to play. But uh, it's not out yet. I'm not even sure when the actual release date is, but I'll be keeping my ear to the wall and my eyes on the streets. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Um, but yeah, you know, do all that normal stuff that you normally would for a YouTube channel. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.